Today we're gonna be showing you some funny face swaps. Oh God, this is gonna be creepy, but also funny. I think of Snapchat because they have that face swap with like your brother or sister. They're kind of for laughs, but I, don't, I wouldn't use it on a daily basis. I love doing face swaps. One time I was doing a face swap with my mom and then I accidentally did a face swap with my golden retriever. That's cool. I remember doing a kid's react when we did face swap challenge. Sometimes, like, it doesn't look normal on other people's faces, and it's like, okay then. That's funny. The baby, this baby right here, it's really weird. I like this one because it kind of works because, like, he has a bald head. Oh my god, what the? <laughs> Okay, that actually, that's really funny. It's twisted, but funny. Oh, that is just really strange and unnatural. Now it looks like he's wearing a hat, and that, and then the baby's bald. His head, the dad's face on the baby's body looks really weird, because it's really, like, it's shaped weird, and then the baby's face is really big on the dad's body. Oh my god, that's really scary, because, like, now he's the baby, and now the baby's the face of the dad. Oh my gosh, I'd run away. I'd be like, oh my gosh, there's a baby man or a baby with a body. They stops are so funny, but so weird. What the, that's just absolutely wrong. That's literally what happened to me and my dog. Oh my God, the little girl looks possessed, but the cat, oh my God, it's Funny. That's kind of scary, especially on the kid's face. It's, ah! I've never seen one with an animal before. It has like the cat eyes, and then the cat has, like, looks like a human. It's just weird. That's not cute or funny, that's creepy. The cat looks cute, but that does not look cute. That's the cat's eyes? Wow. If you see a kid's face like that, and you know it's a face swap, you have to imagine what the cat was doing in that photo. It wanted to kill the camera. Oh my god, it looks like a mini husky. I love huskies. Ah. The dog doesn't look that bad, but the cat looks so kind of weird. I can't tell the difference, actually. I, honestly, I can't. I know that's a dog and that's a cat, cat dog. That's a tricky one to figure out. That looks like a puppy to me, a husky, a baby husky. This it just looks like an animal from Mars. If that like dog was not in the picture, then I would think that the cat with the dog's face on it was actually like a little dog. That looks like it could be real. It works like perfectly because it has like black and white and yet the dog has black and white on it too. Ah, that's creepy. Okay, so the doll has his face and then he has the doll's face. The hair from the doll's face kind of looks like it's like a unibrow. Looking at the doll, and I see that it has a guy's face on it, and that's really funny. The face swapping app actually thought that that doll was a face. I hate dolls, like dolls, like puppets, stuff like that. That's ugly. I hate Cabbage Patch dolls, and that would just be creepy to throw it away automatically and put it in the garbage. I'm oh, sorry, it's just that dude's face and that doll's face on that dude. It looks like he has a unibrow. I do not want to see that for one more second. I am just gonna slowly turn away. <laughs> okay, this is probably the most funny one of all. How do they like make it blend so well? It looks like a wax sculpture. His face, it's all creepy, it's all white. It's all, it looks like he's wearing a creepy Halloween mask. He carved that face into the pumpkin. And then they did the face swap. He looks like Slender Man. Now I'm going to have real nightmares. I couldn't imagine seeing that on Halloween. I feel like if I saw him next to it, I'd be like, what happened to you? Did you turn into your pumpkin? That would be creepy if you like were out Halloween, like going ho trick or treating, and you see that as a jack lantern, I would run to Canada and never come back to America again. Okay, what the heck happened here? That's weird. It's creepy, but I can't look away. It kind of looks kind of real, but I know that it's not. The girl just looks twisted, but the pig is just like, uh-huh, I'm, I'm smiling for the camera. She looks possessed. <laughs> like, she has pig powers. If I saw that, I'd be so scared. Oh my gosh, that's really frightening. And the pig with the girl's face, that's scary too. Oh my gosh. 
That's creepy. It's a pig's face on a girl's face, and the girl's face is on a pig's face, and the girl's, the nose, it looks really weird, and so does the eyes. That is adorable. The girl looks way cuter because of the nose and its own. But the pig does not look anything like a pig. What? <laughs> that looks so weird. He has orange eyes and a banana mouth. That is the weirdest face swap ever. That person made a fake face to try to photo swap it, to try to face swap it. It turned out well. This looks like a garden boy. Like he just came out of the dirt and became a garden boy. This just looks like somebody got really bad at this person and cut off its face. Instead of actually having like a pig or a dog or a cat or a doll, it's fruit. <laughs> it's a fruit. I've never seen anyone do it with fruit. His face is just on the counter like, Someone put me back in my place. And the fruit is like, ha, I took your place. If you have anything that resembles two eyes and a mouth, even if it's two rotten looking tangerines and a brown spotted banana, you could face swap it on the counter. It's not the Starbucks face, is it? Mm -hmm. Oh, I just realized that Starbucks label. <laughs> The Starbucks cup looks funny. It just has a little face on it. Like. Okay, so she has her face on the Starbucks person. I like this one, actually. It's kind of creepy, but cool. That's like one of the Starbucks drinks. My mom would do this. That's kind of cool how the face swap app could spot the face on the Starbucks lady. They put her face on the Starbucks logo. It's like, hey. I'm the new Starbucks logo, look at me. And then the Starbucks lady's like, get me out of this lady's body. All I see is this guy has a mustache and this guy's just, oh, I see it now. It's the nose. I'm scarred for life. It's like he has two faces. And it looks like the baby's eyes have popped out. It looks like a walrus, kind of because they have those whiskers. Oh my God. The baby's head was, I guess, so small to the app that it didn't replace the guy's face with it, but it replaced his nostrils with it. The baby looks like a nose, and his nose looks like a baby. It's funny, but it's scary funny. Oh my gosh. Her neck is like so long and what happened to Woody? The Woody guy actually kind of looks like a cowboy. I think they were trying to take a photo on Snapchat, but then they accidentally scrolled through to the face swap, and it didn't come out well. He doesn't look normal. <laughs> like, of a, like a normal human face on like a big costume, and it actually looks realistic. For some reason, I can see that being Woody. Toy Story 4. That face has Woody. I'm scarred for life. Some of them were creepy and some of them were funny. They were super duper funny and strange and unnatural and kind of scary. Thanks for watching. If you liked this episode, then hit that like button. Bye, everybody. Hey, guys, what's up? This is Lucas here. I'm a producer at the React channel. Thanks so much for checking out this episode. And don't forget to subscribe.